Hey everybody, hope you're having a great day no matter where you are in this world. Today will be the first video in a 12 video series that I am going to be doing on OnlyOffice. Now, if you haven't heard of OnlyOffice, it is a great office suite that you can use on Linux. It is also available on Windows and Mac as well. Now, with OnlyOffice, one of the reasons I use it over, let's say, like a LibreOffice is because it gives me a little bit more professional feel, gives me a few more options to be able to make my job easier, and it's pretty much compatible with Microsoft right out of the box. Why does it have to be compatible with Microsoft? Well, I do a lot of business. In my small business, I run a promotion business and I run an IT business. And sometimes when I'm working back and forth pe with people, they're using Microsoft and I'm using OnlyOffice. And I don't ever have any problems with layouts. I don't have any problems with being able to share documents back and forth and then look all messed up when my client opens them. Everything just works. Now, a lot of distributions have OnlyOffice available in their repositories. It is open source. So if you're working with a big group of people, in a big business, you can use OnlyCloud. They do have a paid feature in there, so you can collaborate back and forth. But for my use case, everything that I'm going to show you in these video series is free. You don't have to pay a dime, and it's open source. So let's just go from there. Now, if you come up here, you've got features. You've got for business, for developers, get only Office. They got pricing, partners, and resources. Now, if you wanted to get only Office. You could go ahead and go through here, or you could just come down here and go get it now and click on that. And you've got enterprise, developer, community. They got the Docker image for Debian, Red Hat for Windows, Amazon machine image. And then you could go back up top. You've got enterprise, dot clouds, workspace, connectors, desktop and mobile apps. If you click on desktop and mobile apps, you can download them directly here for just your desktop. You could just pick what you wanted. It's available in a Snap, flat pack, app image. And then you've got a lot of different Linux distros down here. For Rizzy, Sparky Linux, Amarox, Linux Mint Store, Zorin OS, Deepin App Store, Cutefish. There's several different ways to get the application. What we're in today, I'm going to go ahead and close out of this, is Manjaro. And if you come over to Manjaro, it comes out of the box with only Office Desktop Editor. So let's open that up. And right now it says there are no files. First thing I want to do is go to settings. And I want to go ahead and make it a dark mode because that's just what I like. Let's go ahead and set that. Now, one thing I have noticed with OnlyOffice across different Linux distros is that sometimes the theming doesn't go along with what your default theme is in your operating system. It's real easy to fix. You just zip on over to settings and adjust that. And then, of course, you've got interface scaling right here. You can adjust that and apply and it'll make it a little bigger or you can also change your language change your username so if i wanted to go up here i could put ebuzz central and then go ahead and click apply and we're good to go there now if you wanted to connect it to a cloud let's say you have k drive own cloud c file next cloud life ray you can do that right here or you can create an only office cloud now if you wanted to create that they're going to ask you for some information here and then you can get it set up and then if you want to subscribe to their newsletter you can that's all up to you i already have an only office cloud so what i'm going to do is go ahead and click connect now and i'm going to put this information in and then we'll be right back and once you've logged in all of your documents will show right there and then you could come down here and then you could click on something like my consulting agreement and it would pop straight up and then I could go ahead and start doing work on that. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and close out of that. I just wanted to show you how you could do that. So we are connected to the cloud now. What I want to do is go ahead and zip on up. You've got documents, spreadsheets, presentations, form templates, and you also can create and edit PDFs in this application, which I will go over in a future video that I do in the series. But it's pretty self-explanatory. You've got documents up here. You open a document, you can go right to work. You've got a lot of different selections you can use up here. And if you've used something like a Microsoft, this layout will look very familiar to you. They give you a lot of the same things that you get on your Microsoft Office. It's just a different way to do it. 
and it's open source and you can do it right inside Linux. Now, like I said, there's going to be a lot of different things that I cover on documents, spreadsheets, presentations, form templates, and we're going to be doing a lot of work in there. And as you can see, my cloud is connected right up here. If you have a next cloud, it would show your next cloud right there, so on and so forth. But I'm really excited about this video series because I think I'm going to be able to show a lot of people different things that you can do with a professional looking office suite that is available in Linux. We have a great set of applications that we can get in Linux. Things that let us do 99.9% .9 of the things we used to do on Windows. We can do it with an open source application and I love that. I love the fact that we have that power and I just want to point out different applications that we can use on a daily basis so we're not tied down by the proprietary stuff that's on the market. So my base statement here is if you're interested in OnlyOffice and you want to learn how to use OnlyOffice, zip on over, download it, go to the repository that you're presently in for your distribution, see if it's available. Go ahead and get it installed so you can follow me over these next 12 videos. And by the end of it, I hope you have a stronger grasp of OnlyOffice, uh, a stronger acceptance of exactly what this application can do for you and i'm telling you guys i've used it for two years i would not go back to LibreOffice. it has made my job so easy it has made my job uh, a lot more less time consuming let me say it that way being able to yoke it up right there with my cloud and be able to have everything that i need and do my business no matter whether i'm on my phone on my laptop or on my desktop it makes things simple so in the next video, I'm going to start with documents, and we're pretty much going to have about a two or three video series specifically on documents. And if you've got questions as we go through this video series, please drop them in the comments below, and I will be sure to try to touch them in my future videos. So I'm looking forward to this. I'm very excited about this, and uh, I'm ready to do this video series, and I'm ready to show you exactly the power that you have with only office and get you away from the google docs get you away from the microsoft offices i think we're going to have fun on this adventure and uh look forward to it so i'll see you in the next video do me a favor before you leave today please like the channel likes keep me in youtube's algorithm which means if you found the information in this video helpful somebody else out there might as well and subscribe doesn't cost anything and if you end up not liking me you can always unsubscribe. You also can become a member right here on YouTube for just 99 cents a month, but that's not all. We are also on Utreon, which you can become a member on at $2.99 a month, or Odyssey, which is $4 a month. You can also buy us a cup of coffee, maybe zip on over to PayPal and throw us a donation, or go over to Patreon and become a patron to the channel. All those links will be in the description below. As always, thank you for watching my video, and I will see you in the next video.